Hi, I have a large amount of books from NetGalley for to tell you about in this haul. So yes, it's a haul video. I just did a video and I, I imagine that will go up first, which had my Edelweiss and my print ox that I received in the last two weeks. And these books I've gotten since April the 17th and I got them through yesterday, May 1st. I did already receive new books, but I'm going to put them with the May haul. So the first one I want to tell you about is Lost Daughter by Allie Mercer, and this will be released on May the 14th. Then I got The Mother's Mistake by Ruth Held, if I'm saying that properly, and that will be released on June 11th. And... I, I was looking over at my Edda Weiss notes because The Stranger Inside by Lisa Unger, which I told you about in another video, that will be released on September 17th, but there is no cover for it at this point. Then I got Hattie's Home for Broken Hearts by Tilly Tennant, and this will be out July 10th, and I actually have a blog tour for this title. Then I received from Emma Davies, The House of Hope Corner, and this will be released on May the 10th. I know there's a blog tour, but I don't think I'm signed up for that one. I have Degrees of Guilt by H.S. Chandler, and this will be released soon on uh, May the 16th. I have I Spy by Claire Kendall, and this is an August the title, August the 6th. Then there's A Christmas Boutique by Jennifer Chiaverini. And this is August the 1st, excuse me, October 1st. I then have A Bitter Feast by Deborah Crombie, and that is October 8th. I then have a thriller, and that's Elevator Pitch by uh, Linwood Barkley. That's a September 17th title. I looked over this book and put it back, and I looked, put it, clicked it, and then I ignored it. And after the third time, I said, I think I'm strong enough to read a thriller. And then there's Sniper's Pride by Megan Crane, which will be released on May the 7th. And I started that today, and I'm about 25% into that. I have Truth or Die by Katerina Diamond, and that will be released on July 11th. I have The Honeymoon by Rana Halsall, and that's uh, June the 7th. Then I have a J.T. Ellison title, and I really enjoy her. She co-writes with Katherine Coulter sometimes, and her book is called Good Girls Lie, and that's that will be released on December 31st. Then I have What She Shot, oh, let me try that again, What She Saw by Wendy Clark, and that was released May 1st. I know Shalene, the color book nook, read that and gave it five stars. I then have Keep You Close by Karen Cleveland, and that will be released on May the 28th. The next book I have is Little Girl Sleeping, which is a Detective Katie Scott, book number one by Jennifer Chase, and this is May 31st. I have The Women by S.E. Lines, and that is going to be released on May 22nd. Then I have Crashing the A-List by... Summer Heacock, and that is a July 9th title. Then I have The Book Supremacy by Kate Carlisle, and that is going to be released, released on June the 4th. I have Never Deny a Duke by Madeline Hunter, and that is going to be released on April the 30th. But I want to grab something. When I got... Never Deny a Duke by Madeline Hunter. I contacted the publisher and I said, well, it's part of the series and if I could, would, I mean, if possible, would you send me uh, widgets to the previous two books in the series, which she did. And those are A Devil of a Duke and I'll show the graphic for that. And then she sent me The Most Dangerous Duke in London and the graphic will show for that. So with that because that was a separate note I'm sorry then I got uh, the third book in a new uh, in a series by Betty Rollins and that's Death at Beacon Cottage and it's a Suki Reynolds mystery book number three and I believe I have the first two 
that will be out on June 4th. I have the Amish Widows Rescue, which I already read, and The Last Widow by Karen Slaughter, and this will be out August the 20th. Then I have No Judgments by Meg Happett, and this is a September 24th title. Okay, this is the Betty Rollins title that I thought I had, and that is Death at uh, Dearly Manor. Again, it's a Suki Reynolds mystery, and it's the second book in the series. And this will be out soon on May the 13th. Then I read The Cowboy and His Baby by Jessica Clare, and this will be out on May 7th. I read that, and I'm going to have hopefully have that review up on the 7th. Then I read Invisible Girl by Jill Childs. I have read more than one book by her, and I really enjoy her. And this will be out May the 30th. Then there's All Her Secrets by Sue Watson, who I think I've already also read books by, and that will be out on May 23rd. Can you tell I'm not going to get all these books read on time? Then I have Dead Inside by Noelle Holton, or I'm sorry, Noelle, I messed up your name. I, I Noelle it, it works for Booker and I deal with her almost every day, so I'm excited to read this book. That will be out on May 31st. Then there's Passion on Park Avenue by Lauren Lane, and this will be out May 28th. And I believe this is part of a series, so I probably will go and get the previous titles. Then I have Murder, She Uncovered by Peg Cochran, and this will be released on May 28th. I hope my notes aren't showing when this uh, renders later. Then there's Bold Lies by Rachel Lynch, and this will be released on May 27th. There's A Promise for the Twins by Melissa Sennett, and that is June 18th. I have The Lawman's Baby by Patricia Johns, and this will, I, I have one book that I read by her, one book to be read by her, so this will be my third Patricia Johns title, and this will be out on July 1st. Then I have a four book anthology or compilation, and it's Off Duty Seals, which is an echo platoon anthology so when you see the graphic you'll see that there are four books there Th this uh, was released on April the 2nd and then I have Gone in the Night by Mary Jane Riley and this was will be released uh, May 3rd so right away then I have I believe the third or the fourth book in a series by Emma Talon and it's called Fierce Girl and I have read the previous titles and that will be on May 21st, and that is actually going to be stuck in my TBR probably for next week. I have Jackson by Emily March, which will be released on June 25th. There is The Body Keeper by Anne Frazier, and that is due on June 4th. I have The Long Call by Anne Cleves, and that's uh, September 3rd. And then TikTok by May Sherrod, and that was May the 2nd. I have read it maybe two weeks ago, but unfortunately I haven't written the review because I wasn't feeling good for almost a month. So that, believe it or not, between this video and the Edda Weiss and the print arcs, I believe it's 71, 70, between 70 and 75 books. So I hope that I've got all of them. And even the ones that I got today, I'll just hold over until my next haul video. All right. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.